Mama J, Jeffrey Ross. Hi guys. Okay, you're me. Hang on, I gotta fix this. Dude, on my paper. Uh, all right, you're all set. Can you wrench me? Yes. Do I need to go out and come back in? I don't know. I just typed something. It should should be okay. Nope. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah. Okay. I'm not seeing no chat. There we go. Hi, Sharon. Thank you. Thank you, Jen. Hi, Cheryl. Hi, Jen. Hi, Deb Riley. Hey, Randy. Hi, Kathy, Belinda. Oh, it was great. Trit I can't see. Trinity? Trinity Vlogs. Okay, yes. Hi, Lisa. Everybody's congratulations, Jess. Thank you, guys. Hey, Vinny's Vault. <laughs> Hi, Lori. Randy, Irene, Kendra, Helen. Aw. <laughs> Hi, Melanie. Hey, Patty. Hi, Susan. Hi, Robin. Sharon. Yes, yeah, she did. She was gorgeous. Hey, Jackie. I got your package today. I'll give you a call after my sale. Hi, Judy. Hi, Pam. Hey, Celeste. Cindy Neal. Yes, it is. This is my little... <laughs> it's a troll reindeer. <laughs> Hi, Bev. Hey, Melissa. Oh, it was my pleasure. My pleasure. Thank you, Jeffrey. <laughs> And Randy. <laughs> you could still see this stupid thing in my glasses because I have to tip up to read the the comments. I told Hi, you. Maria. Thanks. I would love to give you one of these to push around. Where's Miss Pamela? I seen her. You seen her? Yeah. I didn't see her. Hi, Dawn. Here, you want to go play with that? No, that's her, Jessica's dad. That's my ex-husband. <laughs> well, one of my ex-husbands. <laughs> wow, Ma. I mean, you really didn't have to go Well, there. they already know I've been married three times. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty tired. I didn't do a dang thing all day today but take a shower. <laughs> and, uh, oh, I got clothes in the washer and dryer. Hi, sis. Yeah, I just didn't feel like doing anything today. I'm like, Pfft. hey, Jennifer Lab Mama. Where is Pamela? Dude, are you blind? Yes, I don't I haven't seen her yet. She said, hey, D, hey, y'all. And everybody's saying, Pamela. I ain't seen her. Hi, Steve. Pamela, post something in cap locks. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I have to have a sale every Saturday. That's my income these days. Oh, thank you, Jackie. She said, Jessica, your husband is very good looking. Oh, hey, Poodle. Oh, oh there's Binks's present. <laughs> Dude, you left it over I'm going to shut that light off. Oh, well, if you're doing that, you want to unplug it? So yeah, I can here. Plug my phone in? Yeah, that, I can't stand that glaring in my glasses. Well, don't get rid of it because no, I'm that not. would be good to take up. 
I'm not, well, I'm not going to get pictures. rid of it. I'm going to figure out how to use it with it not. It's hard to when you wear glasses. I know. But Jessie has her ring light, and you can see it, like, it goes around her pupil. Yeah, it drives me nuts. I, I can't stand it. Oh, you know what? Thank you for reminding me. Sorry, so. Okay, I'm in live chat now. <laughs> no wonder why you weren't seeing nothing. Oh, did you, Kendra? Because that was gorgeous. Hold on. I got to pop out and pop back in. Binksy, get out of my freaking bag, dude. Um, Deanna, she's going in and out, so she'll have to see your, your comment when she comes back in. Well. Hey, Sue. Hey, Mary. How are you? Andrea. Chris There's Pamela. I couldn't see you. <laughs> All right. Chris just texted me. Want an olive bar thing? Because he's going to Wegmans. Oh, is he? Because <laughs> yeah. I always pick on olives, so he asked if I wanted Hi, to. Rebecca. Um, Binks is licking. Dude, I know. Get out of my freaking cheese it's, uh Binks is in Jessica's bag of cheese. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't care if they weren't the hot and spicy one, but weirdo. All right, hold on. Whose comment am I looking for? Deanna Church. Oh, absolutely, because these are hot and spicy Cheez-Its. Oh, no. What did she say? Because I can't find Oh, there we go. Did you find it? Thank you, Deanna. No, my dress wasn't um, antique. Nope. My dress, actually, uh, we found it last year, and it was um, on sale, but... We, I didn't know it until, because it was, obviously, they never bring you the sale stuff first. They always bring you the the full price ones first. And so, um, she did, they brought it over, and it was on sale for $600. But the alterations that I had to it um, was $675. So, <laughs> right. <laughs> so, all together, it was about $1,300. Right. Which I didn't think was too bad. I mean, six hundred dollars was a slam and deal for the dress itself, but I, uh, I wanted to add a lot of things to it. Poodle so. said the overlay on the wedding gown was the best ever. Thank you. That's what I liked most about it too. Yeah. It looked very uh, whimsically. Hi, Lisa. Mom, you're chewing your gum really. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I see I can't be like Pamela and chew gum because I don't know when to stop chewing. I'm gonna try and Just do it. Just stick it on the roof of your mouth. Yeah, I I'll try. Um, okay, so I just wanted to say one thing um before we start the sale. Um I've had a lot of people contact me regarding their items from my last sale that they haven't received them. Or they, there's no tracking information that it just says uh, a label was created. So I just want to explain to everybody what's probably going on here. Well, uh, we'll also preface, preface by the fact of obviously it's the holiday season. So there's an influx in, in packages anyways. But also with COVID... A lot of people are choosing the online shipping route, which means I'm assuming it's about five times worse this year with packages right? in comparison to, you know, any other time of year. Right, because a lot of people are shopping online. So, but what I think is happening, because trust and believe all of your packages have been mailed and have been picked up by my post lady. Um... I put a lot of packages out there. So she's got to carry them from the side of my house out to the front and to her truck. I'm sure that she is not scanning every single package. Or they're not scanning them once they get to the 
the right. main post office. Some of the packages probably did not get scanned. And those are the ones that have no tracking information. Banks, buddy. Come on. So <clears throat> I just want everybody to be a little bit patient as far as um, getting their packages. Um, I, you know what, Poodle? I have not been to the post office yet. I was supposed to go in my last video. I said I was going to go, and I never made it there. I'm planning on going on Monday to, to check my P.O. box. But I, um, I just want everybody to be aware that your packages have all been shipped out. It's just a matter of when you're going to get them. Uh, so I am just apologizing ahead of time for the delay, even though it's really not my fault. <laughs> so... Oh, you, this little guy? Yeah, he's kind of cool. I said, I'm going to wear him today. He's a cutie. He's a, he's a troll reindeer. Yeah, I was going to go out today, but I'm like, you know what? It's the day after Christmas. It's going to be crazy out there. So I said, nah, I'm staying right here. <laughs> so... I hope everybody had an awesome Christmas. I hope that some of you got to be with family. Um, I did watch some awesome uh, videos on YouTube from the reselling community. I know Joanne from Work in Progress, uh, Progress was on Christmas Day. And Katie from Vintage and Vinyl had a beautiful uh, light video of all the Christmas lights and everything down in... Um, in Florida, in, um, oh my God, I now I can't think of the name. It's where the lighthouse is. Oh my goodness. Oh. I'm sure there's quite a few lighthouses in Florida. Well, no. Um, do you guys remember where the, the video was that Kate, uh, Katie from Vintage in St. Augustine? Thank you. That's it. Thank you. I was talking about it last night, and today it just, like, left the brain. Uh, yeah. So, anyways, I hope you guys got to see some of those videos, too. So, um, so today I have um, 50 regular items. There's a couple Christmas things. Actually, no, there's, like, one, one Christmas thing. And um, I have uh, three offer-ups. So, let's get started. All right, how about if we start with um, some cats? Okay, I, I got this uh, cat figurine. Um, but I remember, now this is a home co figurine, and it's in perfect condition, no cracks, no chips. But I also remembered that I had this other home co cat figurine that would go with these guys perfectly so I decided to throw this one in and make it a foursome so as I said these are in excellent condition no cracks no chips there's the marking on the bottom that's the home coast sticker that wore off so you will get the set of four it's fourteen dollars number thirty five for the set of four. Fourteen dollars, number thirty-five. Uh, let's see. <laughs> All right. That one had water in the bottom. All right. Uh, next, I have a vintage Avon decanter. Um, it is like a milk glass hobnail with the transferware uh, of the roses on the front. It does have its stopper. <laughs> Binks. Seriously, dude? 
No, that's what I believe in that. <laughs> All right, so, oh yes, thumbs up. There are 186 people and only 42 thumbs ups. Go out of the chat, guys. Give the thumbs up and come back in. <laughs> Virginia, there she is. How you doing, Virginia? Hi, Nita May. Hi, Grace. So this is gonna be $6, number 16. Six dollars, number 16. <laughs> uh, Lynette Curtis. Lynette Curtis. You got it, Lynette. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> no, buddy. Really? He's like, I, it's like watching somebody on a tightrope. He's trying to climb through a trove of glassware. Okay, let's do these and get these out of the way. Yeah, he's supervising, all right. All right, next up, I have this vintage set of salt and pepper shakers. We have a grandfather clock and the rocking chair. These are really cool. I have never seen anything like these before. No cracks, no chips. That's where the uh, pepper comes out of. And the salt comes out of the top of this one. They have corks in the bottom. So this set is going to be $12 and it's number 25. $12, number 25. These are really cool. I've Cheryl. never seen those. Cheryl Hoskins. You got them. Okay. Um, I have an adorable little elephant. Hey, Nebby. How are you? Merry Christmas. I have an adorable little elephant figurine. He's from Japan. There's his little stamp. No cracks, no chips. Trunk up. <laughs> he's, he's cute. He's only like, he's about three inches long and two and a half inches tall. He is $5, and he's number 39. $5, number 39. Cheryl. Cheryl Hoskins. <laughs> All right. Next, I have a beautiful piece of ruby red glass. It's this beautiful, um, I guess you would call it a cruet. You could use it as a cruet, um, a perfume bottle. Um, you could use it in your bathroom. It's in perfect condition. No cracks, no chips. And this is six and a half inches tall. It's nice and smooth on the bottom. They polished the Pontiel mark. This is $10, and it's number 36. $10, number 36. Hello, Myra, the thrifty auntie. Belinda Carroll. Belinda, you get the um, beautiful red cruet. Thank you, Belinda. Terwilliger. Next, I have a set of tea light holders, uh, tea light candle holders. These are from Yankee Candle, and they're just these very, um, these are like the, your color that you like. Sage green. They're like a sage green. They're a flower. Really, really pretty. No cracks, no chips. 
Oh, thank you. I know, Sue. How have you been? So you get the set of two for $8, number 40. $8, number 40. Yes, tea light holders. Yankee Candle. Diane Carter. Diane Carter. You got them, Diane. Hey, fat birds. Merry Christmas. I got your Christmas card, you uh, ladies. Thank you so very much. I appreciate that. And I also got a card from, um, um, oh dear, besides fat birds, there was somebody else that sent me a card. Oh, Corey, the thrifted artist. I got a uh, beautiful, two beautiful Christmas cards from these ladies. So thank you so much. Okay, next I'm offering this awesome measuring cup set with the, um, it's got a cover on it. Oh, you like... you Yeah, you peel that off. <laughs> well, you have it. It's got to be this it way. It goes yeah. this way, but... Brand new, never been used. You uh, put this on your wall and you hang the measuring cups from this metal bar. And this is $10, number 38. $10, number 38. Jeffrey Ross. Jeffrey, you got it, my friend. Did you have a good Christmas, Jeffrey? Oh, Dana, are you serious? Oh, my goodness. Both of Dana, oh, Grace, yeah, 2010. Oh, I'm sorry, Grace. I will definitely keep them in my prayers. Dana, I mean. Oh, my goodness. Oh. I'll tell you. All right. Um, I am offering, this is an awesome piece. And I could not make out what this says on the bottom. Can you read that? Um, I don't know. It's made in something, but it says G-Z-E-C-H-O in the middle. G E no G Z E C H O or G Z O Oh Czechoslovakia G Z O It's it's C Z probably it's probably Czechoslovakia Um it's this awesome Whoops orange I love this color creamer pitcher I guess with this beautiful scene on it So cool. It's got a green rim around the top. Isn't that awesome? Oh, no cracks, no chips. There's the stamp on the bottom, but it's pretty faded, so it's hard to read. This is going to be $10, and it's number six. $10, number six. Yes, it is, Dana. Melissa Lynn Colbert. Uh, yes. <laughs> it is a troll reindeer. <laughs> All right. You know, uh, I told you guys before, when I was little, like five, six years old, these things scared the crap out of me. I was so afraid of trolls. They scared me. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to start selling off some of my roosters. So I have a set of three here for you. So we start off with this guy. Uh, 
Um, I don't know where these were made. I have no idea, but they are bisque. So there's this one. There's this one. Oh, here, this one has a sticker, which really doesn't help me much. Made in Taiwan, especially if I'm reading it upside down. And then this one is a home co. So you get all three, all three pieces for $12, number 12. Three pieces for $12, number 12. Elaine Wallace. Elaine Wallace, you got them. All right, all right. Oh, you're very welcome. I was excited to do some, you know, filming and everything and share it with you guys. I could hear you. Every time you push start. Oh, it, could you? All, -doo -doo, -doo -doo -doo. I'm like, you could at least turn it down. I know. I didn't even <laughs> think to turn it down. I was a nervous wreck. What can I say? But why were you nervous? I have no idea. But let me tell you, I killed my reading. <laughs> so yay for me. I killed it. <laughs> yes, it was beautiful, I thought. Um, thanks, Nita. <laughs> oh, my mom, she's, oh my gosh, my mother was a blubbering fool yesterday. My mom, ago. or the other day, she can't even go to church because the music and the songs, she immediately starts bawling. Yeah, she is, she is something else. Really, really bad though. I mean... <laughs> She goes, that's why I can't go to church or anything. <laughs> oh, it was so funny. I'm like, Mom, relax. <laughs> oh, Yeah, it was funny. Um, hey, Katie. All right, next I have this white milk glass hobnail. Another, okay, now this one, I glued the stopper in because it kept going sideways. It wouldn't sit straight. So I glued it in here so it would stay the way it's supposed to. But it is just, um, I don't know if this is Fenton or not. I'm not positive. But it's just like a perfume decanter or whatever. Just a pretty decor piece. This is $10 and it's number 26. $10, number 26. Hey, Stacy Brinkley. Susan Cole. Susan Cole, you got it, Susan. All right. Next up, I have, um, oh, this overstuffed house. Hello. That's our house. Huh? I said that's our house. Yes, it is. <laughs> um, I have a set of Wedgwood. The set consists of this little uh, plate. I'm not quite sure what it was used for. I don't know if something else came with this or not, but I have the little plate. And then I have this trinket box. It's beautiful. 
little cherubs on there. Look how cute those are. Cherubs. <laughs> the only problem that this dish, uh, trinket dish has is this chip on the inside rim. What's the paper? This piece of paper was in here when I bought this from the estate sale, and it says Grandma Vivi. So I'm just going to leave that in there. So I am offering the set for $12, number 24. $12, number 24 for the Wedgwood. Um, Annie Burris. Annie Burris. Okay. Hi, Annie. How are you? All right. Next I have, um, you know that Dayer makes beautiful, um, trays and tins and stuff like that. And I have this really pretty, it's a little... Would you call that a bowl? Not a bowl. Well, it's it's like a it's like a deep dish. Yeah, it's a deep dish, I guess. And it has this beautiful fruit pattern on here. And I mean, it's in excellent condition. You could see, you know, beautiful, no scratches or anything. And this is six dollars, and it's number forty one. Six dollars, number forty one. Mm -hmm. oh, very thirsty today. You got the bells, Dana? Where did you find them? She wanted my bells. <laughs> oh. Where did you find them, Dana? Oh, from Thrift You, did you? <laughs> well, congratulations. Oh, yours are gold? Okay. Do they light up? I don't know why I'm yelling. Because you always do. I don't know. <clears throat> they do. Oh, that's awesome. Very cool. All right. Um, Let me see. Okay. She's clapping for herself. <laughs> I have a beautiful, I'm doing it as a set. Um, I have two pieces of Balik made in Ireland. These are absolutely gorgeous. First, I have this little bowl. Of course, it has the shamrock uh, pattern on it. I mean, it is made in Ireland. Right. <clears throat> Here is the mark on the bottom. And then I have this beautiful little vase. It has a, uh, like a, uh, what do you call that? Um, Oh, lattice, I guess, a lattice uh, kind of a pattern on the sides. Um, Leanne, I haven't been to the post office. I plan on going on Monday. It's just beautiful. The vase is five inches tall. And this bowl here is four and a half inches around, and it's about two and a quarter inches tall. So you get the pair of these for $22, number 14. $22 for the pair, number 14, for the Balik.
for uh, CLC. Okay. Hi, Connie. You got it, Connie. Thank you. All right. Um, just reading the chat. <laughs> Aren't they beautiful, Dana? Um, next, I have this awesome tin. This tin is in, like, excellent condition. What is in it? Buttons. Look at this. Isn't this pretty? I love the colors. Isn't it beautiful, Melanie? And then inside is full of buttons. Yeah, take, whoops, I forgot about that. There's all kinds of buttons in here. And there's like some, look at these. Button covers. And then little bags of buttons. So you get everything in the tin, plus the tin, for $12, number 45. $12, number 45. Vinny's Vault. You got it, Vinny's Vault. Hey, Vinny, can you please make sure to email me um, your information before you um, offer on any other items? Um, Jess, will you put my email in the um, description? Because you're new to me. We got a, a troll, too. Um, where? Look up. I mean, I did. Well, he, he was in there for a while. Yeah, well... But he, he wasn't saying nothing. Oh, well, he just said, I love your box, Thrillo. I mean... Meaning... Yes, no. Ma, but I mean... Yeah, no. He was fine before. That's why I didn't do anything. <laughs> the troll is on my shirt. Yes. Okay. Um, you know, I don't care if you're going to troll around, but you know what? Let's not be inappropriate. I don't like being talked to that way. You know what I mean? Okay. Next up is a beautiful. Thank you, Dana. Um, I have this beautiful little music box. Look at this little cutie. Yeah, see, everyone said he was being nice. That's why. This little one is a music box, and I am not going to wind it, but um, it plays You Are My Sunshine. Isn't it adorable? Um, and as I said, it plays You Are My Sunshine, and she is... Five and three quarter inches tall. Five and three quarter inches tall. She's $12 and she's number 21. $12, number 21. Myrna. Myrna Spratt. I was going to say that. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you, Myrna. Um, let's see. Okay, we are going to do something from the 1970s. I have this set of four wooden plaques, and they are the cutest thing ever. Let's start with this one. <laughs> Look how cute she is. Then there's this one. And 
And then this one, which is my favorite. Aren't they adorable? And they're all in excellent condition. All the wood is in perfect condition. They're all beautiful. And you get all four for $12, and they're number 49. I know, aren't they? <laughs> I know, they, I, they do. They actually do. Lynette Curtis, you got number 49, Lynette. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, these are beautiful. <laughs> yeah, they do look like the ladies on Petticoat Junction. How funny. You're welcome. Thank you. Um, let's do a couple of little items here. Anybody need a kitchen timer? I have this little silver apple kitchen timer. I don't know who made it, but it's really cool and it works perfectly because I tried it out. Um, it's $8, number 15. $8, number 15 for the kitchen timer. P. Greg. You got it, Paulette. Thank you. I know there's a lot of people out there that love milk glass, and I just have this little berry bowl. It is milk glass, and it's, it's called the bubble pattern, obviously. <laughs> I believe it's anchor hocking, but I'm not positive. But it's just so cute, perfect for fruit. It's $3, number eight. $3, number eight. This would be good for... Um, you got it, Anna. It would be good for, uh, like, dips, too. All righty. Um, Next up, I have a set of um, Anchor Hocking Moonstone, and it is um, this saucer. It's in perfect condition, no cracks, no chips. Oh no, I lied, here's a, here's a chip right here. I didn't even see that. Oh my gosh, I just noticed it. Little chip right on the edge. That's right in the that's right well, in the I'm glass. Just showing you. Yeah, that's right in the glass though. It's like a, a manufacturer's defect. Right in the glass. And then I have this one. This one is in perfect condition. Beautiful uh, serving dish. And if you wanted to, you know, you could set it like that. Really, really pretty. Now, this bowl is, whoops, wrong way. It's about eight inches around. And the saucer, I'm thinking, is about five. Oh, actually, the saucer is six and a quarter. So, you get <clears throat> both pieces, $12, number 33. <laughs> There you go, Lori. <laughs> hey, good morning. All right, Anna, it is yours. Uh, okay, I have, <clears throat> excuse me. A shit ton of figurines today, huh? <laughs> All right, I have a, a really cute set of um, Home Co. little baby figurines. These are so cute. Look at these. 
Look at the faces on these little cuties. Look at them. They are adorable. There's the back. <laughs> and then this one is the little girl with the teddy bear. Just adorable. I love them. So the pair of these. Um, and there's no cracks, no chips. The pair is $10, number 18. $10, number 18 for the pair. Come on, let's go. They are, they're adorable. Okay, this did, no takers on those. The little cutie. No takers than the little cuties. Alrighty. Um, <laughs> yes, I am excited to be a grandma one of these days. Hi, Josie's Butterfly Kisses. Next, I have this beautiful amber bowl. Um, this is, this reminds me of the daisy button pattern minus the daisies. <laughs> um, other than the daisy right there on the bottom, it's really, really pretty. And it has like diamond point. These are all like diamond points. I have no idea, Dana. I couldn't tell you. I don't, I'm not up on my glass, but <clears throat> it is a beautiful bowl. Hi, Patricia. Um, this bowl is seven and a half inches around, and it is eight dollars, and it's number 31. Eight dollars, number 31. the heck is he doing? I don't know. He came and busted in the bathroom and um, jumped on the sink. Did he? Like a window. Yeah, he never does that. Annie Burris. Yeah. You got it, Annie Burris. Hi, Cynthia. Well, I'm shipping from um, New York. So New York. just keep that in mind. It all depends on where you are as well and how heavy the package is. Merry Christmas, Cynthia. I hope you had a good Christmas. Oh, Patricia Gessner said she didn't know you were here. Oh, hello. Yes, I'm here. <laughs> yeah, no honeymoon with COVID going on, so. No, yeah, but I'm, I'm in... On my other, I'm actually, I was already logged into my actual YouTube channel, so I just had her give me a wrench on this one instead of the other one that I was using to help with the sales. So, oh my God, Jessica is me. Oh, okay. That's right. They're used to sincerely, Jessica. Okay. Yeah. Alrighty. I gotcha. Okay. Um... Vinny's Vault, hey, I gotta go, but I didn't get your email. You can contact me through my store. I don't know what your store is. Well, is he, it's he, Vinny's Vault? He provided it, but oh, he was supposed to contact you via well, your email. I'll see if I can get a hold of him. Um, <clears throat> next is um, this vintage trivet. It is made by Lego Japan, and it is this. This reminds me of the 70s. I don't know why. It is so cute. Well, let me show it, but I wrote it down. And here is the um, sticker on the back. So this cute little trivet is going to be $8, and it's number 32. Hi, Elizabeth. Merry Christmas. 
Eight dollars, number thirty-two. Elizabeth, you got it, Elizabeth. You didn't waste no time, did you? <laughs> <clears throat> um. All right. Up next is this beautiful <clears throat> Anchor Hawking Relish Dish. I have two of these to offer. They are both in excellent condition with no paint loss, no cracks, no chips. They're beautiful. Uh, they are going to be $12, number nine. The first two people to type in number nine will get the relish tray or dish. Cheryl. Cheryl Hoskins. All right, so we sold one. And if this one, nobody wants this one, I will keep it. Nobody wants this other relish dish? Number nine. Oh, thank you, Elizabeth. $12. Okay. Uh, I'm going to do one more item and then we're going to do an offer up. Let's do this. What the heck is that? Um, tell me what those pictures are inside of there. I think they're cats. What do you think they are? Cats. Cats. Working in a dish. Yes, I am. This ring, um... I bought this ring for my father for his birthday one year. And when he was um, passing away, I I took it, you know. Oh, thank you. He loved it too. He never took it off. Um, next is this cobalt blue, like carnival glass, little... Um, cup. Hi, Jane. Inside, it has pictures of cats. I know they're hard to, to see, but there's little cats inside. It's really, really neat. Uh, this is going to be $8, and it is number 10. $8, number 10. Polly's Projects. You got it, Paula. I hate this pen. It feels rough when you oh, write with it. Well, that's all I have right now. It's not easy breezy. I have to get some more pens. All right. All right, everybody, if you need to refresh, go ahead and refresh. I will wait a minute before we start the, um, the offer up. I moved it because I was afraid you were going to drop something on the screen. <laughs> I don't know. All right, so. Um, no, we're not going on a honeymoon right now. We had originally wanted to go to the UK and do kind of bop around there. But um, obviously with the state of the uh, world right now. <laughs> It's not safe, so we're, we're not going nowhere for the foreseeable future. Right. <laughs> Me too, sis. 
Okay, I am offering for this first offer up is this gorgeous Bohemian um, decanter. What would you do with that? You're supposed to pour shots? Wine or something. Oh. It's about nine and a quarter inches tall. And it comes with five little glasses, shot glasses. Um, none of these have any cracks or chips. Um, the paint is really, really good on these. So we are going to start the offers at $12 for this set. Um, and we are going to go for uh, one minute and 30 seconds. Uh, I thought it was a minute. Well, for the lag, because it's lagging today, they said. So we will start right now. Start. Lisa said, you can always go to the falls like they did back in the day. I see it all the time. So, like, I... Right. <laughs> we live in the falls. So, so uh, yeah. <laughs> no, thank you. Yeah, we, we live, like, five minutes from the falls. <laughs> so, the starting is $12. We have Jane at 15 You get five glasses and the decanter. Beautiful set. We have this overstuffed house at 18. Myrna at 20. Hello, low V. <laughs> oh, Sue, it's it is breathtaking, I have to say. If you go way back in my videos, though, I did post a video of a tour of Niagara Falls. If you wanted to watch that, I think you would really enjoy it. In 1959, I'm sure it was fabulous looking uh, right. around here. Ten seconds, everyone. Two, one, stop. Okay, we are refreshing to see who got it. Uh, it looks like Jane Newhouse, $25. Jane Newhouse, $25. Congratulations, Jane. I know, I can't believe it either, but I did. <laughs> it wasn't too bad. All right, Jane, you got it, girl. Here, I'm going to move these over for you so you could grab them. So these... Emma went to the falls today, actually. Oh, did she? Yeah. Jessica's um, maid of honor is here from uh, Florida. Well, she's originally from. She's originally from um, Lockport, New York, but her boyfriend is from Florida. So she took him to see the falls today. And it's a perfect day for her because there's just enough snow and it's really pretty. So... Anywho, I I don't think I ever saw that. Did you see? Did you see my video of the falls, Sue? What was the question? Um, it was a Hitchcock movie about the falls. Oh. Um. You're keeping your decorations up until COVID's over, Elizabeth. A lot of people said they were doing that. Oh, did you? Oh, 
Oh, well, go back in my, in my, uh, it's from like last year. Um, I posted it. All right. So next I have this really pretty, uh, this is a hand painted Japan, uh, figurine. And apparently, um, this is actually the Virgin Mary, and this is her mother teaching her out of the Bible. And I forget who's, who Mary's mother was. Somebody help me out with that because I have no idea. I, I cannot remember. Somebody told me. But anyways. Um, is her name Anne? St. Anne? Oh, maybe. Well, I don't know. There's two people that just said Anne. Okay. Anne? Oh, it was Lisa that told me. Okay, yes. Okay, so this is St. Anne and Mary. And it is hand-painted, and there is the Japan sticker. It's a beautiful figurine. It is $10, number 42. $10, number 42. Hey, good morning. Okay, you got it, Anna. I have it written down as religious music figurine. Does it sing? No. I don't know why I have that in there, but it's not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, alrighty. I have a cute little set of salt and pepper shakers. These cushions are literally... I know. They have these, li oh, that's your patron saint. Oh, cool. Little uh, vegetables on there, like carrots and beets or whatever. Vegetables. Vegetables. And their corks are inside. Oh, so I, uh, <laughs> I don't really feel like trying to get them out, but. There's no cracks, no chips. There is um, crazing because they're old. These are $6, number one. $6, number one. Oh, did you, Sue? <laughs> Patricia Gessner. Patricia Gessner, you got them. Okay. I have, I have to pick a seat too. You, I don't even know what, I don't know what. You would have, well, I think how it works is you pick it when you make your confirmation. Oh, I never made my confirmation, that's why. I thought you did. No, I made my communion. I never made my confirmation. Got another rooster. This guy, look at the tail on this guy. He's awesome. He's pretty cool. He's bisque, but Did he's you put a different password on here. Yeah, for any particular reason. No, but it's the one I use uh, for the bank. So he has no cracks, no chips. He's in excellent condition, and he is twelve dollars, number twenty nine. $12, number 29. That was starch, Niagara spray starch. I remember that. Cheryl Hoskins. You got it, Cheryl. Yeah, that was Niagara spray starch. I'm really behind. I'm going to have to. She had to get her thrill. <laughs> yeah, I remember now that Randy, uh, Randy brought it up. <laughs> I don't know if they still make it or not. I really don't know because I don't use starch. So I don't know. I'm going to look next time I go in the store. Yeah, Niagara Spray Starch. Holy cow. That is funny. 
Elderly Poodle says yes, they do. They do? Oh my gosh. What was starch for? To make it stiff? Yeah. Well, what, what would you want stiff? Like, like collar? collars, oh, okay. um, you know, like your your cuffs maybe, you know. Um, we used it on... Um, your hair? <laughs> well, yeah, I should have starch for my hair. No, we used it uh, when I worked at Stella Niagara for the priests. The white... Um, the white cloths that he uses to wipe out the chalice and stuff like that. We used it on those things too, but yipper. Okay, next I have this cute little set. Um, they go together, but they don't go together. I was gonna say they are similar, so that in that retrospect or that aspect, they go together. They both have fruit on them. They both have gold handles. They both have similar colors. So I'm just selling them as a set. This is a real pretty vase picture, I guess. You could put like a couple stems of flowers in there. You could use it as a cruet for oil or vinegar. And this one is just a little picture. I'd be afraid to use that for anything. Your other sister than went to Stella Niagara, really? I used to work there. So these are ten dollars for the pair, number nineteen. Ten dollars, number nineteen. Hey, Gino. Merry Christmas, buddy. Need a May. Nita May. All right, Nita. How you feeling, love? Her and her husband have COVID. Mm. Ridiculous. No, everybody oh, knows. Okay. I was going to say hippo. <laughs> <laughs> A survivor. My mother went to Stella Niagara, Dana. Yep, and she's 85. Stella Niagara's been around for a long time. It looks so creepy. It looks like a ye olden It like, is. It's beautiful. It's beautiful in there, though. I don't remember it, really. Oh, Vinny, put my email in again, Jess. Okay, Vinny, Jessica's going to put it in for you right now. It's the one that would be with the wrench, and it says, oh, my God, Jessica, that's me. So, hold on. Okay. The nuns were apparently nasty, I thought. All nuns were nasty back in the day. I thought they were supposed to be holy. What are they slapping people for? I don't know. <laughs> um, next I have this Fenton covered jar. It is in perfect condition. Perfect condition, no cracks, no chips. There is the Fenton logo on the bottom. Yeah, I know. She looks really good for being 85, my mom. Uh, this is going to be, let me show you the top. It's just beautiful. This is $12 and it's number 30. $12, number 30. Lynette Curtis. Lynette Curtis. You got it, Lynette. Yeah, I mean, I had some experiences with the one nun um, at the one school I went to and it wasn't pleasant. They would lump you up in a heartbeat. <laughs> Ideally, I'd like to leave at like 5 by 15-ish. Okay. Okay, next I have this little... Um, Scotty. A little Scottish Terrier. He is a salt shaker or a pepper shaker, but he has no mate. But he's still a little cutie, and he could be used for display. <laughs> he is cute. No, I just wish... <laughs> I can't help it. <laughs> 
He's four dollars number eleven. Four dollars number eleven. <laughs> Uh, precious lavender buttons. Ah, Joanne Faber! You got it, Joanne. All right. Did he not sell? No, those sold. That's why they're over there. No. All these sold. No. This, yes. No, this did not. Are you sure? That didn't. This I know didn't. these didn't. Yes, those didn't. I thought they did. Mm -mm, don't mess up my flow. <laughs> oh, I think I have to grab. What's the the daher tray? Was that the there. blue one like that? No, it was the round metal one. Oh, okay, yeah, I accidentally put that in the way. All right. Okay. Oh, All right. Dear. So this didn't sell. No. no okay, ma'am. Little a little mixed up. Nothing unusual. Mm. All right, I have some green Wedgwood. Um, now, two of these pieces have repairs, which I didn't see when I purchased them, but they're still beautiful pieces. So we have this really pretty um, trinket dish. It has like the same pattern as the blue one did, the cherubs. As you can see, this is where the uh, they fixed it. Everything else is perfect on it. So there is the fixed job right here. So there's the trinket box. And there's this little cup. Now, I don't know if this was to put a candle in. I really have no idea. That's all I could think that it would be for. Or uh, maybe pens and pencils. But it's only... It's only like two and three... No. It's about two and a quarter inches tall. And like about two inches around. And this has a repair as well Dang. on the bottom. Oh. And then I have the matching lighter. That's a lighter? Yes. What? Oh. It's got the matching lighter. What's that? So, Binks, come on now. So you get all three pieces for $14, number 34. Oh, Randy, thanks for the Christmas card. <laughs> and Cindy Warman, if she's up in here. Anyways, so it's all three pieces. 34. Annie Burris. Annie Burris. You got them. Okay. Randy Heilman and Cindy I just Warman. That. I thought you you're talking about you got a card. No. Oh, uh, I just got your cards in the mail. <laughs> no. Hi, Davida. How are you? What? You were holding it up with the address. <laughs> because I have too much going on here. I can't even think straight. Binks is driving me nuts. Well, what do you want me to tell you, man? <laughs> Get your you. butthole out of my face, dude. <laughs> I'm telling you. Hi, Binksy. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. He's on a roll. Uncle Mark and Aunt Dana. No, stay down. Stay down off the table or else you got to go. Oh, my word. Oh. 
He won't stay Free. on my lap. Here Free he now. comes again. Hey now, this is what dreams are made of. Hey, Binksy. You want to go lay down, buddy? Come on. Come on, Binksy. Binksy. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, he's he's going all right. Yeah. Come on, Binksy. Right. Binksy. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Um, yeah, he's an exhibitionist. He, I mean, I love him to death. And he is such a mama's boy, it's not even funny. Um, anyways, let's do this awesome tablecloth. Yes. This tablecloth is... Uh, you did measure it? I did measure it. Didn't break down? <laughs> it's 70 by 58. 70 by 58. It does have some staining on it. Um, not really bad, but like I said, I haven't washed this. But it is beautiful. That's the pattern on the corners of the tablecloth. And then... There's some staining. I know, I just uh -oh. said staining. But... It's just beautiful. And it's a very nice quality tablecloth. It's, it's thick. Thick. It's thick. Six what did I just knock down? I don't know. Oh, my chapstick. So, as I said, it's what 70. What size is it? I mean, not size. Um, what shape? Uh, it's rectangular. Rectangle. Um, it's $15, and it's number 47. Yes, primary colors. There's the colors. Debbie Muir. Oh, okay, Debbie. Where are you going, Tyler? The potty. Oh. You got it. It's a beautiful um. <laughs> I don't. Never mind. I'm not even. Oh my god. I don't know. It can only happen to me. Never mind. Not even going to talk about it. Really? Oh. Oh. <laughs> did you sell that once before? No. I swear you did. No, I did not. I was going to sell it, but then I ended up doing Christmas stuff. I swear you showed that before. Was there one similar? That was a life one as well? No. Did you sell it and somebody never paid for it? No. I really swear that no, we've done this before. No, I never did. Okay. I never did. Never. Next is this life mm -hmm. recipe book. Oh, thanks, uh, Lucid. <laughs> this is really awesome. Um, it comes with all of your little um, alphabetical order index cards. What year? Is I will let you know in one second, um, Vinny. So let me take the the recipe, the thing cards out first. The dividers. The dividers. Oh, guess who's back? Back, back. Oh, he's he's playing with the chapstick. <laughs> I know I saw it on here somewhere. Guess who's back, 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 back. Oh. Well, let me show you. It is, it has, this whole book is full of recipes. Corn relish. They're already all uh, perforated. Oh my Jesus. Hello, sir. Come here, Binksy. They're already uh, perforated so that you could easily rip them into their each card. And 
I don't know how many recipes there are, but let me just say there is a lot. You could see how thick it is. Um, I do not see a year on here anywhere, but it looks to me like it's like maybe 60s. Um, it's pretty awesome. I tried so hard. All right, just get it. out. Just get out. <laughs> I tried my best to make it. I swear to God. Get out. Get out. My son. Did you guys hear him fart? I didn't mean to. He came running in to use the bathroom. I'm surprised he didn't shout. Oh my God. <laughs> Only in my house, guys. <laughs> Jessica's gonna pee her pants over there laughing. <laughs> Anyways, this is going to be $12, number 27. $12, number 27. Oh, it's in your house too, Vinny? <laughs> Vinny, what do you want, dude? But why does it have oh. to be when I'm filming? <laughs> Polly's Projects. Paula, you got it. <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. Ah! And Binks is gouging Jessica's back out over there. It's going to be a fun day. <laughs> and I don't even have any alcohol to drink today. <laughs> See, she should have left the house. I know. I just might have to when I'm done. Yesterday I was watching um, uh, Mimi's Treasure Cottage and she was drinking a nice glass of wine and it just looked so delicious. I had no wine, no nothing. All right. I like wine every now and again. There you go, buddy. I have to be in the mood for wine. Take a seat there, kid. There you go, buddy. I'm just, I am. I am going to go to the store. It's only up the street. Oh, my. OMG. He's real spastic right now. I yeah, think. I know. Um. So, next item is this adorable. I'm thinking that this could either be. Cookie jar. Uh, that's what I was just going to say. A cookie jar, I'm assuming. It's this adorable basket of apples. Oh, you're enjoying mine because it's nice and loud <laughs> and chaotic. <laughs> oh, spiked eggnog. I love eggnog. Well, oh, Grandma's my got God. Bailey's. My mother's got Bailey's That's at her house, so I might have to just take a trip over to my ma's house. <laughs> um. It is a cookie jar, I'm assuming. It's in excellent condition. There are no cracks, no chips. It, it's not marked on the bottom. I don't see any anything that says uh, Fitz and Floyd at all. Nothing on the bottom. It is beautiful. And it also comes with... Salt and pepper shakers. It was, this was made in China. Salt and pepper shakers. Look how cute these are. What? Oh, dear. <laughs> um, they both have their stoppers. So here we are. Oh, I think they oh. <laughs> Number 46. Yeah, she's getting tickled today, all right. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. John and Mary Ann. All right. John and Mary Ann. 
Oh, Pat Hall, you were a little late on that one. Oh, hi, Gina. <laughs> so, um, John and Marianne, uh, my daughter's going to put my email address in the chat. Please make sure to um, email me your information um, as soon as possible. Ah. Uh, Okay, next I have this giant blue ball jar. This would be great for storing um, grains. Yeah, grains in it, cereal, um, whatever, you know. It's awesome. It's really large. This is like a um, two quart size, I'm thinking. Large and in charge. Yes. It's it's a nice size. It's M &M's actually oh, lots of peanut M Ms. No, it's ten inches tall, and this is going to be ten dollars. Number seven, yes, sun tea. You could do that in here. It comes with a cork top. I have no idea where the glass top is. Myrna Spratt. But okay, Myrna, you got it. It says, what does it say on the side? Bail here. I don't know. But anyway, so there's that. Yeah, that would be good for uh, collecting your change. Buttons. Absolutely. Buttons, whatever. I mean, it's huge. It's a good size. Um... I'm trying to get, um, I'm trying to sell a lot of my larger items because I'm trying to stay away from really big <coughs> items anymore. So I have this absolutely gorgeous swan. swan. Look at this swan. It is beautiful. This is a, um, a hand-painted ceramic piece. I mean, they didn't do much painting other than the bill and the eyes, which are absolutely beautiful. Well, I mean, yeah, and then paint it white. But, I mean, um, this was made in 1985 by C.W. And, I mean, this is a good size swan. What a gorgeous planter. No cracks, no chips, perfect condition. This is $14, and it's number three. $14, number three. Isn't it gorgeous, sis? <clears throat> if nobody buys it, maybe I'll keep it and plant in it this summer. It is beautiful. It really is. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, sir. I can't see my phone. Uh, oh, Laura. Vintage thrifted treasure. Hi, Laura. You got it. Thank you. Hi, Binks. What's up, buddy? She's like, Hi. Oh, now you're being nice to me. Hi. What's up? So Hi. You know, just want attention. Hi, buddy. As per always. What's up? Wow, they give you like <laughs> literally three m and Two, four, six. Six peanut M&M's. Well, it's better than no peanut M&M's. Hi. He's rubbing on me now. See? Okay, buddy. All right. Now I have hair stuck, stuck to my chapstick. Next is this beautiful green glass. Um, I don't know what you would call this. I'm thinking it's a vase. It has the two handles. The and it has Yeah, I know. It has gorgeous strawberries on it. Just beautiful. Oh, thank you, Gina. Look how cute he is. <laughs> Um, so this, 
there's no cracks, no chips. It's just beautiful. The green is a beautiful shade of green. It is $10, number 37. $10, number 37. Right, Banksy? <laughs> Vintage thrifted treasures. Dude, he's trying to eat the buttons on my sleeve. No, you can't have that. What are you doing? He wants attention. <laughs> Hi. Now he's chewing my thumb. Oh, okay, yeah. <coughs> are you teething or something? Ow! <laughs> come on. All right, come on, get down. Come on. Holy moly's. All right, next up. Oh, he's got food right over there. He's got plenty of food. What, this piece? I know, isn't that gorgeous, Poodle? Beautiful. Yeah, he's jealous. He is. He absolutely is. As soon as I put the camera on, out he comes. All right. Next, I have this set of Pioneer Woman look-alike dishes. <laughs> Two, four. There are six dinner plates, and they are a very uh, heavy plastic. So there are six dinner plates, and six luncheon plates. They are all in great condition. They're beautiful and they look so pretty together. They're gorgeous. They would be good for like a picnic. Yeah, perfect for a picnic. So you get all 12 pieces for $12. Number 48. 12 pieces for $12, number 48. Do not microwave oven, dishwasher safe, top shelf only. Jeffrey Ross, I believe, got them. Yeah. All right, Jeffrey, you got them. All right, let me slide some stuff over here, guys. I'm going to bring some stuff over here and we're going to do another offer up in a second. All right. Jess, I'm going to set these over here that sold. Yeah, it's fine. I just... No, I know. You're eating your oven up. <laughs> okay. Next, I have this vintage chopper. These usually sell well for me. Um, this is made by Federal Glass, uh, Federal Housewares. And it's this dark avocado green chopper. It has the little thing in the bottom to protect the glass on the bottom. Works perfectly. It's in perfect condition. No cracks and no chips. It's $10, number 17. $10, number 17. Pet Hall, do you want the apple cookie jar? Agamoy. Okay, you got it, Anna. What's the matter, Paula? Uh, I believe uh, she had a friend pass away. Oh. That's oh, I'm I'm sorry, Paula. Oh, on Christmas Eve too. Yeah. Um. Actually. Um. Never mind. It's not my place. I know. Um. Uh, if Pat Hall's still in here, it appears that um, 
Uh, John and Marianne, who wanted the apple basket cookie jar with the salt and pepper shakers. That won it. Yeah, that they um, are offering it to you if you would like it. Oh, sure, if you are passing John and Marianne. Okay, yes, yeah, she will take it. Okay. Okay, so the that's going to go to Pat Hall. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that was very sweet of you. Thank you, John and Mary Ann. All right. Now, what has to... Oh, okay. Those. All right. One more item, and then we will do another offer up. Guys, this next item um, is really so very pretty. It is this gorgeous... These are made in Germany. It is this beautiful, let me turn it, creamer and sugar set. It's on the small side, um, but it is absolutely stunning. It's in perfect condition. Um, it is called Wild Rose. That is the pattern. The creamer has just a single, like, little bud on the other side. Um, there's really no paint loss. Here is the bowl. Here's the lid. Beautiful coloring in there. It's like pink and yellow. Gorgeous. And the flowers are on both sides of the sugar bowl. So you get the set for $10, number two. $10, number two. All right. Uh, Myrna Spratt. Myrna, you got it. Where do you get this? It is gorgeous. Spratt. All right. My next offer up item is a Christmas item. Oh, joy. And it is going to be this gorgeous made in Italy nativity Italy. and manger. This is in excellent, perfect condition. Hi, Shannon. How are you? Merry Christmas. It is just beautiful this is the back how heavy oh it's not heavy at all it's probably maybe a pound and a half yeah it's not heavy at all um you can see it says made in italy on the back and it's in like new condition Yes, I did. <laughs> so, we are going to start offers on this at $15. Uh, where's my clock? You will have one minute and 30 seconds. Ready? Start. Tyler's here. Oh. <laughs> yeah, go down and ring that bell in his ear for farting during my video. <laughs> you know, I don't think anybody heard it until you brought it. No, to they it. did. I don't think so. They heard. I don't think so. <laughs> um, you know what, guys? I didn't put the pictures, the family pictures in the video that I posted. But I am going to add some of those pictures uh, maybe at the end of one of my haul videos instead. Hi, Binks. Nobody. Oh, wait. Well, See? Um, <laughs> I told you. <laughs> well, some people said no and some people said yeah. I don't know how you couldn't have heard it. 
<laughs> didn't hear it, but you smelt it. <laughs> Uh, so far, I think Dana's got it at, we have 30 seconds left. Mm. Thanks, dude, please, <laughs> give me a break. <laughs> Joy Brock is at 30. <laughs> oh, he stopped my timer. Well, you just got a couple bonus seconds. Yeah, you guys got more seconds now because mm. the timer got stopped. Ah, Bingsy. We have 20 seconds left, everyone. Did it smell as bad as it sounded? <laughs> I wasn't close enough, thank God. He, wa he just wants attention. I point. know he does. He what am I supposed to? I don't know. Three, two, one. Stop. <laughs> She's doing it extra long <laughs> just to irritate my son with the cowbell. <laughs> um, all right. I got Elaine Wallace, $33. Elaine Wallace, $33. Congratulations, Elaine. All right. All righty. Hey, Banksy. Oh, let me shut this off. Okay. Um, I have, I think this is a really cute set. But, you know, that's just my opinion. <laughs> um, it's an orange. I'm, assu I'm assuming this is Japan pieces, but it is this set of fruit. A we have a pear. And an orange. And an orange. Um, there's no cracks, no chips. What is it? Um, they're just decorative pieces to set in your kitchen. Oh, why do they got handles? I have them? no idea why they have handles. I wondered that myself. It just makes them kind of unique. But they're in great condition. And, um, you get the set of two for $14. Both of them for fourteen dollars. Number forty-three. Number forty-three. This is how we do it. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, next I have a gorgeous piece of art glass. I'm thinking it is, um, Empoli. Uh, it is this beautiful footed bowl. It is just beautiful. Oh, thank you, Cam's Follies. Here, give you a close up. Everyone is obsessed. I know, everybody that. loves my pin. Every time you start wearing some of them. I've been wearing them. I know. Um, <laughs> so, this is, let's see, six inches tall. It would look amazing with a candle in here. It is, it is gorgeous. I, you know what? I think somebody um, gave this to me, friend mail. I'm pretty sure it was friend mail, but I can't remember who, who it was that I got it from. Uh, this is going to be $14, and it's number 44. $14, number 44. It's gorgeous. Oh, poodle. Yes. You got it, Poodle. Yeah, it is gorgeous. It really is. I'm probably going to kick myself for selling this stuff. Where are we going to put it? I don't know. All that's right, why then. I'm selling it. Hey, that's how you do it. <laughs> All right. You guys will probably remember this from my last, I think it was my last haul video, um, is this gorgeous 
Hall Creamer and Sugar Set. H A L L or H U L L? H A L L. Uh, no cracks, no chips, no crazing. The creamer does have a little bit of uh, paint loss on the gold. Because if you look at this sugar bowl, it is pristine. It is pristine. Yes, it is. So there is a, the little bit of paint loss on the gold on the creamer. Jane said autumn leaf. Yes. Mark. I believe so. Autumn leaf. There is the stamp Superior on the bottom. Hall quality. Yes. This is a beautiful set. Um, it is $12 and it's number 13. $12, number 13. Debbie Muir. Debbie Muir, you got it. Muir. Thank you. It is a gorgeous set, Debbie. It's like perfect. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Petite, yeah. petite. Petetti fruits. Okay. Are those glass or are those plastic? No, they're plastic, but they're I cool. Next, I have these awesome hobnail <laughs> wall plaques. Faux milk glass. Faux milk glass. These are plastic. Sherry, what you have to do is um, go um, send me an email. My daughter will type it in the chat. Send me an email with your name, your mailing address with the zip code, and your PayPal email. I don't know. She didn't buy anything. She wants to sign up ahead of time. So, oh. So that, yeah. So she's putting that in the chat for you now. Um. Yeah, how cool are those? And you just hang them. They're they're like this. So you get. I actually I saw a whole set. It was a mirror, and it had like stuff like this that went with it. And when I first saw it, I'm like, wow! And I ran over, and then I realized it was plastic. I was like shocked. Hey, Rach. <laughs> Merry Christmas. So the set of these is $10, number four. $10, number four. Melissa Lynn Colbert. I'm um, yeah. Yeah. I think. All right, you got it, Melissa. All right. So next I have... Still in the box. Petite. 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 Petite fruits. Sugar and creamer on a wire wagon. This set is the grape set. So I took it out. They These were brand new. I don't know how, but this one had a chip. So I tried to touch it up the best I could. Well, then they must not have been brand new. They, they were brand new in the them. box. They had them all. Look at this one is still wrapped up and it's in plastic. Look. So it comes with the little carrier. You get the creamer. It's and here's. Bowl. <laughs> it's an open sugar bowl. I'll show you from there. Make sure there's nothing wrong with it. Here's the sugar bowl. No cracks or chips on the sugar bowl. And that's the way it looks. It's adorable, actually, I think. Um, it's $10 and it's number five. $10, number five. Hi, Tiger Purple. Tiger Purple. Tiger Purple. <laughs> you got it. All right. Let's see if I can get this back in here the way it was. There we go. 
All right. Okie dokie. Next I have this bag of vintage cookie cutters. In this set, you will get this one with the black handle. It's a biscuit cutter or a donut cutter. Actually, yeah, that's for donuts. Then we have a heart. A club. <laughs> Or, uh, what do you call it, shamrock. A circle. We have this one, which has a plunger, and it has directions for it. And then a not-so-vintage dog bone for people that like to make their own um, dog bones for their pets. For their dogs. So, <laughs> yeah, for their dogs whatever i knew you were gonna say something uh <laughs> so you get all of those for six dollars number 23 six dollars number 23 sis you got them sis all right all right we're getting down to the nitty gritty. Next up is this awesome crumb catcher. Crumb catcher. It just has the very corner is missing right here. But it is made in Japan. It says it on the back right here on the bottom. But it's a very, you know. Ornate. Ornate, yes. I do not know if it's, it's probably silver plated, I would think. Um, it is $10 and it's number 20. $10, number 20. Bye, Casey. All right, next up is this beautiful cobalt blue bud vase. Such a gorgeous color. I, I love it. I really do. It's got a real pretty um, scalloped top. That's the bottom. This is $10, number 28. $10, number 28. Elizabeth, go. You got it, Elizabeth. All right. Did you, did you make sure to write down what the manger sold for? Yes. Okay. All right. Next, I have this gorgeous planter. This is really a beautiful piece. It is made by Yona, and it is numbered. There's no cracks. There's no chips. But it does have some like mineral deposits on the inside because as i said i believe this is a planter but you could also use it as like maybe a console dish really a pretty piece and this is pretty long this is like about 16 inches long and about four and three quarter inches wide. It is um, pottery, I guess. It's got the marks from the kiln on the bottom. 
really, really pretty. This is $20 and it's number 50. $20, number 50. Uh, Joanne Baber. Joanne Baber. You got it, Joanne. I have one more regular item and then one more offer up item, everyone. And then we are done. So my next item and my last item. Is that a glass and a thing? Yeah. Okay. Is this beautiful water pitcher, bedside water pitcher set. It comes with the pitcher and the glass. Uh, no chips, no cracks. Excellent condition. And this is $12, number 22. $12, number 22. Lynette Curtis. Okay, Lynette. Um, I'm going to do this last offer up item, and then I'll go over some of the pieces that didn't sell. Now, I have had this uh, set for a while, and this is uh, from the early 70s, I believe, and I have kind of pieced together a set. This is Anchor Hocking, and it is called Lido Moreno, I believe, and it is this awesome ball, they call it a ball pitcher, um, with the ice uh, lip here, and it's in the beautiful amber color. There's no cracks, there's no chips. Is that amber or like a honey color? It's a, yeah, a honey, honey color, a light amber color, and I have five glasses that go with it. I have three of this smaller size. And then I have two of this larger size. So there's two of this size and three of this size. So we're gonna do an offer up on this, uh, the set, the pitcher and the five glasses. And we will start this out at $14. And you will have a minute and 30 seconds. Whoops. Okay, everybody ready? I, I believe it's called Lido Morano. Um, they also call it Crinkle. And, um, oh, what's the other name? I can't remember offhand. Um, all right, ready? Start. Starting at fifteen dollars for Is the whole 14? set. Oh, fourteen dollars for the set. Yeah, they call it um, crinkle and oh darn, I can't think of the other word for it. But it's a really nice set. No cracks or chips in any of the glasses. Really nice set. Deanna's at 17. Oh, you had them in college, did you? Yeah, they're really nice. I actually have some of the smaller, um, the smaller glasses like for juice. I like those for if I need to take a pill or something. And they're they're made really well, you know. So Yep, -er. so we'll finish this up and I'll go over some of the stuff that didn't sell, guys. We have 19 seconds left. Ten seconds left. Butt cheeks are falling asleep. Your butt cheeks are yeah. falling asleep. <laughs> All right, stop. 
Okay, and I believe it's Deanna, I think. Mm -hmm. I think it's oh, maybe not. I don't know. We're refreshing. Elizabeth, $18. Elizabeth Gove, you get it for $18. Thank you, ma'am. All right, so I'm just going to go over the items that didn't sell really quick. Um, I had this awesome set of kitties. Home Co. Kitties. It's a beautiful set. Yeah, so, hold on. Let me look. No, they didn't. No? Okay. Because you had the for 14, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah, no, they didn't. All right. So I originally bought just this, the set of three, and then I had this extra one, which is also Home Co., and it goes really well with the other three. So I was asking 14, but I will come down to 12 for all four, number 35. $12 for all four, number 35. Elizabeth. Okay, you got it, Elizabeth. I have this um, beautiful Anchor Hawking Milk Glass Relish Dish. It's in excellent condition. Oh, that's what you came for? <laughs> oh, that's awesome. It's in excellent condition. No cracks, no chips, no paint loss. Beautiful, beautiful relish dish. And it $12. is $12.00. Number nine. Number nine. $12, number nine. Elizabeth. All right, Elizabeth, you got it. Um, baby figures. Next, I had these two um, Home Co. baby figurines. Oh, my gosh. Look how cute these are. They are absolutely adorable. They're in perfect condition, not a crack or a chip anywhere. And you get the pair for $10 and they're number 18. $10, number 18. Jane Newhouse. Jane Newhouse, you got them, Jane, thank you. Next is this uh, Made in Japan Crumb Catcher. The only issue it has is the, the corner is missing on this side. But it's in otherwise very good condition. And this is $10 and it's number 20. $10, number 20. Uh, Sue Terwilliger. Sue Terwilliger. You got it, Sue. It's really very ornate. Like, look at the pictures on here. It is really stunning, I think. Oh, you're welcome. Um, I have to go get the tray. These sold. Oh, those did? Yeah, okay. I'm assuming. They're not highlighted. The orange pear set and then the... Dar tray. Okay. Um, and also was this set of fruit pieces. I think these are so cool. They're like so like 50s or 60s, I think. Um, there's no markings on the bottom, but I have a feeling they're Japan because they're pretty lightweight. Um, so we have an orange and a pear. And the set is, come over here, $14, number 43. $14, number 43. Elizabeth. Okay, Elizabeth. You got them. And my last um, piece that did not sell is this beautiful dare a uh, tin, like uh, a deep dish with this beautiful fruit pattern. It's just, it's really gorgeous. 
Uh, this was six dollars, number forty one. Six dollars, number forty one. Hi, Judy Reardon. Elizabeth. Well, Elizabeth, you cleaned me out. Thank you very much. And that is it, guys. Everything oh, has on, sold. Uh oh, things. Jessica made a mistake. Hang on. For number 18. What's number 18? The Home Co. Baby Figurines. I thought it was Jane, but it appears that it is Elizabeth. Um, it appears that it is Elizabeth. Okay. So, Jane, we made a mistake. Um, you did not win the, um, the Home Co. Baby Figurines. It was Elizabeth Gove. Are you still here, Jane? Oh, Elizabeth said Jane can win. Jane, Elizabeth said you can have them. Okay, sweetheart? Josie, you're back, but I'm done now. <laughs> I just finished. So, Jane, you, you, okay. Okay, you're good then. <laughs> Elizabeth is going to take the crumb catcher. Oops. Oh, so, Sue, you're giving it to um, Elizabeth? Okay. Okay, we got it. So the crumb catcher goes to, um, call you Marianne. Oh, that's right. Mar oh my gosh, Marianne. I'm sorry. <laughs> that's Marianne Piper. I forgot she changed, changed her YouTube name. Who? Who's Marianne Piper? Um, butterfly, um, Josie's Butterfly Kisses. Oh. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it. We're we're sold out today. So hopefully I will uh, get everything uh, packaged up tomorrow. Oh, thank you, Diane. Thank you for coming. Thank everybody for coming. Thanks. So hopefully I'll get invoices out um, either tomorrow night or Monday morning. I'm glad you did too, Sue. Thanks, Myrna. Thank you, Cheryl. Pamela, I'll see you later on tonight at your sale. Thank you, Pamela. <laughs> Thanks, Lisa. Rebecca, Joanne. Hey, Joanne Baber, did you get your little package in the mail yet? You're welcome, Chicago lady. Thank you for coming. Thanks, Elaine. Thank you, Lori. Thank you, Jane. Oh, not yet? Okay. All right, guys. We will catch you. I'm going to have a haul video coming up for you uh, soon. Because I did go to... Um, she was talking about filming it today, but she didn't feel like it. Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>